Hey, and welcome to Yodit's Table. Today we'll be doing something a tad bit different than the norm, which is seasoning our cast iron. Here I have a 15 inch cast iron that I will show you how to season. So you'll need your cast iron, a sheet pan that's lined with aluminum foil, and you'll also want to grab you a really good oil, something that has a super high heat content. So here I have some avocado oil. You can use some vegetable oil or some shortening. Alrighty, catch you in a jiffy. So to start, we're gonna go ahead and preheat our oven to 500 degrees. And then we're gonna go ahead and take a pretty generous amount of oil and pop that right on. And you really wanna get into all the creases and all the crevices. So what this helps you do is turn your cast iron into a non-stick and it also helps prevent rusting. Of course, when you get cast irons these days, they do come pre-seasoned, but I like to season it again just to make sure that I am retaining my cast iron. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip this bad boy over. Damn, that shit is heavy. And I'm gonna do the same here as well. You wanna get the handle, you wanna get everything. Give it a nice base. It's like putting lotion on your ashy ass elbows. Same, same, but different. So now that our oven is preheated to 500 degrees, we're gonna go ahead and pop that open. So on the bottom, I'm gonna put my sheet tray and on that top rack, I'm gonna go ahead and put my cast iron in upside down. Be careful because the oven's <laughs> Put that in, we're gonna go ahead and bake our cast iron for approximately 45 minutes. And we'll be back. Alrighty y'all, so it's been about 45 minutes since this has been baking. We're gonna go ahead and take it out right about now. You do wanna use some oven mitts because Alrighty, so now your cast iron is ready to use. I would allow it to come to room temperature before putting it away. And also you do wanna note that cast irons are not intended to be used with soap. You do not wanna use soap on your cast iron. And of course, as time progresses, as you're using it more, the flavors will build. And so just be sure that you are not using soap to wash it. And then additionally, that you are seasoning it probably once a month, especially if you're using it often. Alrighty, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Peace until next time.